Texas and Missouri, of course, like most other states across the country, got results before midnight on election night. KCTV 5's Leslie Aguilar is live for us now to explain why things were so much more efficient here. Leslie? Carolyn, the biggest reason is mail-in ballots. There was a huge increase in these across the country. Here in Platte County, they had more than triple the amount they had in 2016. And those laws on when and how they are counted vary from state to state. In Missouri, election workers can start processing mail-in and absentee ballots five days before the election. Now that means bipartisan teams of election judges compare the log of ballots checked in with the stack of envelopes in front of them. They also check signatures and make sure the envelopes are notarized. Then they can take the actual ballot out of the envelope and make stacks that are ready to scan. Platte County started scanning those stacks of absentee and mail-in ballots on Monday, so they were ready to tabulate them shortly after the polls closed on Tuesday. Uh, if we hadn't been able to start the process five days before, we, we would be maybe getting, uh, getting results today or tomorrow. Now, Pennsylvania state laws do not allow them to even start processing those mail-in votes until Election Day, and that's why it's taking them so long. Coming up at 5 o'clock, we're going to take a look at some other states' laws and why they could change in the future. Reporting live in Platte County, Les Laguilar, KCTV 5 News.